What's going on guys, Zex Says is here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to record your Xbox 360 gameplay with your Dazzle DVC 100 or whatever Dazzle you have on the, on the software you're using Pinnacle Studios. Um, I'm making this video because I got a YouTube message of a guy who was what he watched my Black Ops 2 video where I got the Killcam DSR. It was a test for my Dazzle because I was testing the audio. And he asked me saying, how did I record the colour? And how did I get in 16 by 9 So because of his request, I'm going to make this video. And yeah, because even personally, what, with what I'm going to show you, I had no idea how to do it. And this is the only way I could actually do it because there's no actual way from what I could find. I looked all the way through the internet. There's nothing I could find. So what I was told to do is get this software called AMCAP. Uh, download link will be in the description, all the download links will be in the description, but th this is all you have to download. Basically, I was a bit iffy about this because I never heard of it before, and the website looks a bit, I know, it looks a bit odd, but I scanned it, and there's no viruses from what I can see, and from what the computer can see, so that's okay, I'll keep it if, like, you know, I believe it. So I'm going to keep it, I'm going to use it, and it's worked from, well for me so far. So what you're going to have to do is, you're going to link this up with your Dazzle, just go into Devices, and once your Dazzle is plugged into your Xbox, or not your Xbox, your PC, it'll be there, so you just click that or whatever. So then, to get the colour, you want to go into Options, uh, Video Capture Quality, or Video ca Capture Filter, I keep getting that wrong. And basically you're going to put this down to C, C, C cap B, or D, or C, whatever, it doesn't really matter. Just as long as it's heat C cap, because this... Um, when your Xbox is on, it automatically puts it on to that NTC uh, underscore M. And it does that straight away when you upload the software anyway, or when you uh, when you start the software. But that's all you need to do with that software. It's pretty pointless, but you know, there should be a back route around it for uh, Pinnacle Studios, but there's not, so yeah. So I'm just going to put on my Xbox now, actually. Just so we can show you. So basically, you're going to open Pinnacle Studios. I do, I do it this way, I open Pinnacle Studios first and then I open AMCAP, I don't know, it's just a routine I have. So basically I'm going to do this and it's going to load up and, okay, I don't have my TV box on because I've got them both coming through the scared and they interfere with each other. Yes, yeah, so that's great. Um, I, for this, using the Dazzle DVC 100, I have to play in 480p because it's not HD, so I can't use the HDMI. So yeah. It's, I've got used to it though, so it's okay. So basically, I'm on this screen, this is Pinnacle Series 14 HD. So I go into my AMCAP. See, it, your Xbox loads up on this then, first of all. So then, and you'll see it's not in colour in the background as well. See, that's not colour. So basically, what I'm doing is I'm going into Video Capture Filter. I'm going into the drop down bar on Video Standard. And I'm going to go into CCAM B, and you see it instantly turns into colour. So you go apply and OK. And X that out, and then you go to import. Now this is just going to make a show on your screen here. So, um, with the settings you have to change on this, it's basically when you're beside your Dazzle DVC 100 here, I just have a composite. You might have an S video, that doesn't matter though. When you click on this, just make sure that's on N N S NTSC. I can't read today, fucking hell. So, um, yeah, make sure that's on NTSC. Because C, or C can might work, I don't know, but I use NTSC anyway, it's all I was told to do. When you've got the software first, it's on PAL. That's all you need for your PS3. Uh, PS3, this doesn't apply to PS3 at all, it's just Xbox 360. So um, with PS3, all you have to do is use Pinnacle Studios, you don't need AMCAP or anything. So it's a lot handier, it's a lot easier. So then to turn it by to 16x9 is literally 16x9 there. Put that in 16x9, but make sure before you do this, it's in colour. So what you do is... When you open Pinnacle Studios, the import one, uh, even after you change the CCAM the first time, you have to change the CCAM again. So open, back, open AMCAP again, it's going to show this. That's perfectly normal. Just click OK. Then go back into Options, uh, Video Capture Filter, down again, and you'll go into CCAM B, or any CCAM, doesn't really matter. I think it kind of just differs in the colour a bit. But you straight away notice that in, in AMCAP, you won't get any video going through that because it's going into fit, uh, Pinnacle Studios. So that's pretty much it. Um, I can record now. Actually, speaking of that, once you go into Star Capture, again, it's going to go back to black and white, so you're going to have to change it from AMCAP again. It's a bit tedious. You're going to have to do this every time you record, but you get it, it's worth it, kind of. Well, <laughs> it can be worth it. If something funny happens, if something good happens, you know, you've got it covered. 
But yeah, that's basically it. So if there's another route around it, I won't tell you. But there isn't. And I've got the software and I'm one who's very protective of his computer. Um, I've gone through so many different uh, video capture softwares and this one's actually worked. But that's beside the point, really. I know that might give viruses to my computer, but they were safe. I made sure they were safe before I actually demoed them. So everything I download on this computer now is safe. And my computer's running very smoothly. Even with AMCAP, even with all the stuff I've downloaded on it, because I've made sure they're safe. But it's it's safe anyway, so there's no point in being worried about any download issues. So, um, I can't. I think the website is amcap.com or something like that. I'm listening to a bit of Skrillex by. So yeah, um, if it's typing AMCAP, I think yeah, it's AMCAP download. I'll show you now. I think the website's a bit um, iffy, but I went with it anyway. Yeah, let's click on that software or er, save download there, and it's legit save download. So yeah, for those wondering, this is your answer. And uh, nothing much to it really, but if there was another route around it, I'd, I I would rather it personally as well. But there isn't, so we're gonna have to deal with it this way. And if I help you at all, you can leave a like down there. It really helps me out. And if you want to see more videos like this, I won't be making PC videos. I probably won't anyway. Uh, more I'm, I'm predominantly console and I had Steam but I didn't use it so I just deleted it there literally today. So yeah, if this uh, worked for you or if you need any issues or if you have any issues and you need to um, contact me again just message me on YouTube or go on my Twitter that'll be in the description. Um, I'm on that basically every day so if you want to ask me questions about your stuff I'll answer you back probably like straight away. So yeah, so um yeah, thanks for watching and see you later.